Hi guys and welcome to this video. Today we are going to look at how to make light trails with videos. Lots of people ask how to get light trails in a video. I just want to show you what I'm going to be using. So this is the video that I'm going to use and as you can see it's just a dark room and uh, just moving around a laser and we want to get the light trails off the laser. So import it into After Effects, make a new composition with it. And what you need to do is, as the layer is selected, go to Effects, type in Echo. There's a couple of ways to do the light trails. I'm going to uh, do this one method in this video, and maybe I'll do the other method in a different video. If we look at the video now, it shouldn't have changed much, but it should produce a small trail, as you can see there. We want a bigger trail, so what we're going to do is, we're going to tweak some settings for the echo effect. Let's make the number of echoes to 3, and that is making the trail longer. That means if I make it 10, that is going to make the line 10 times. You can change this depending on how long you want your trails to be. We tweak the echo time setting that will create a dash effect. You can uh, make the dashes closer or far away by just changing the numbers. So if you want a dash effect in your video then you can use the echo time. So you can change the things like decay, which will affect the tail of the light trail. And when I decrease that value, it shortens the light trail. But it makes a cool effect. But if I increase it, then it will kind of stay solid. And that's all the settings that you need to know when you're making a light trail video. So if it's a big traffic, you can use these settings and it will make a cool video. You need to keep the camera still when you're taking the video. That will make the video look better. If you have a shaky camera, then the light trail is not going to work. And thanks for watching this video. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next video.